Okay, so style icon, legend, and rap artist Tyler the Creator recently announced his next project, Chromacopia. There's many speculations online about what the album means and will center around it. But if you are a real Tyler fan, you won't listen to those speculations. I remember his rap radar interview, he mentioned how fans were wrong about his Sir Baudelaire persona. They thought it was based off French poet Charles Baudelaire. But Tyler confirmed that he actually got the last name from the characters of series of unfortunate events. Folks think that the name Baudelaire comes from the poet nigga. I don't know shit about that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> it's this it's this show called Limity Snickets and Unfortunate Events. Mm. Um, it's this book I used to read when I was in eighth grade. But we're not going to be talking about what the album is about. Today we will be discussing how Tyler next project will influence the fashion industry yet again. See, you can't deny that comedy if you get lost in every other Tyler the Creator project influenced the way we see fashion. I noticed a lot of people wearing penny loafers, cardigans, and brown cargo pants ever since comedy if you get lost came out. In projects like Cherry Bomb and Flower Boy, you notice Tyler's influence on streetwear culture with their vibrant pants and colorful shirts. Honestly, I wear bomber jackets and cardigan sweaters because of Tyler. Since movies are a huge influence for Tyler, when seeing the cover art and video for Comicopia, it reminds me of movies like Doctor Strangelove and Citizen Kane. Maybe Tyler might have us rocking military clothing like in the 60s and 70s, in which people were wearing Doc Martens and green military coats. But besides that, I have noticed artists having a more darker tone, like green and gray, in their music videos, Charlie XCX for instance, including FK Twigs. Comment down below on what you believe Tyler Creator next aesthetic might be. 